Good morning, Planet Earth. Oh, she would have been like, wow. Some really old school. Oopsie, I'm my yellow mellow clear pad. Oh, oh my god. Making of Judge Dredd. That's pretty sweet, isn't he? I am the law! Oh, shit. What's that? Sinclair Spectrum game, so the old. Computer magazine. Look at that. How much his magazine is, let's find out. Have you never played with Hot Wheels? Are they an electronic set? Me neither. It looks old school, but I don't think it is. I don't mean. Mm. A little bit of battle tank there. Boom. There's corners there, but yeah, it's all the, the more modern stuff. Never mind, just not for us. You can see that look on there. And it's boxed. Ooh, pretty decent condition, isn't it? See how much it wants for the lock on. Lock on! The latest interactive experience from Sega. Two handsets. Two headsets. Power booster. Nine life countdown. Lock on warning signal. 40 meter range. Reflective beam capacity. At around $99 per set, it's the most interactive fun you'll have this year. This is here. It's cocked up Yeah, he's seen fucking better days, hasn't he? How much is he? Seven quid. Seven quid. It's not worth a risk on seven quid. Have you bought much? <laughs> Video pack there. Oh, Stevie Lad? Some. Some stickers here. Hi. <laughs> Edmund, straight there. What is he? <laughs> 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 no, I don't think so, man. Oh, 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 chest here. I know. I'm not sure. Oh, 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 Hard push to find some nineties cartoons. Oops, I'm not even gonna pick that back up. The classic Jurassic Park. On the roof, get away. I'm in the willows. Right, guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna delve into this and dig to the bottom and see if I can find any cartoons. If I can, I'll come back to you. Got my stash of your chest, but none for us. <laughs> Could have been pretty special, couldn't he? Yeah. He wasn't like in absolute tatters. Ugh. Never mind, son. Anyone remember that? Well, of course you remember the snowman. A fucking great movie that is, man. Yes, big shout out Alan Jones, lad. Come on, son. Oh, it's a radio. It's a radio. It's a long It's a long It's a long It's a It's a It's a 
put in there for us. It's all pretty much fill out night filler. Never mind. Let's keep looking. Are you announced when you were a kid? Have a massive crush on the said you heart. She was close, her explains it all to me first, but then clearly she was the old Sabrina. Is there anyone with Salem on the front? Anyone with Salem or Cat? Nah, never mind, let's keep going. Salem, what are you doing? Nothing. You're in a chat room again pretending to be a woman, aren't you? I like the attention. I would marry Kate Ashley. Maybe Groot was pretty cool, isn't he? Yeah. Brand new, right? Like. Do you know how much, uh, you know how much they want for Grugo? Let's find out. Are you not for any game? I'm telling you, if you are just starting to get into game collecting, I would still highly recommend coming to Good Fair because there are some fantastic titles at really good prices. I'm going to see if he's got any GameCube stuff. Let's ask him there. Let's there's some retro stuff here that we've got. PS1, some Game Boy bits, another Game Boy bit, some DS stuff. Let's ask if he's got any snares or not like that. More VHS, but they all look like Disney. Yeah, the old aristocrats. Don't get us wrong, there's nothing wrong with Disney. But it's not the type of cartoons we look for. You know, if you're a big follower of this channel, you'll know it's more the TV. 90s cartoons or 80s cartoons we look for. Never mind. Quite the collection of Toy Story stuff here. In fact, he's definitely original. Any date on him, right? But he definitely looks like an original one. And then there's original RC there, but unfortunately, someone snapped his bastard eyes off. I oh, could have had him. But a stationary set. Nah. Never mind, let's keep looking. Old school game, yeah, I'll certainly old school put the room. You can tell by the, the case that he may be old. And you only still have the room, get up there. Some little Mario Kart things here, two quid each. How much are the smurfs? Get up there, the smurfs, lad, pound. What should do? Anything else in there? Nightmare before Christmas, full set, fiver. I'm wrong with that. Oh, that's good, isn't it? Nice. They're collectible. Yeah, I thought so. You must have collected them out of the uh, the tokens out of the tea bags. This is going for about, I don't know, I've looked at it ages ago on eBay. It's just an ordinary calendar, I think, yeah. but then you take the prints out. Ah, right. Good them, aren't they? Aye. Very, very old. Aren't they? Aye, I pulled them off a while. I had. Let's see if I can put you down there. Wow. I pulled them off this wall here. I loved I loved the wall that much. You always find some really cool old school board games. But like, I'm just always worried that there's just parts missing. You know, like, look at these ones. I'll get back on in there, man. Fucking go on, son. Yes, sir. That's what that is like, but half decent, though. Oh, Bobby collection there. Yeah, was she? No, it's not dated, but I was marked since Barks' one. Big shout out to Bobby fans. Again, you know, like, you know, 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 you Is that? Yeah, I dream a dream. 
I think that's it, isn't it? No, it's not. When I was five year old, baboon. Yeah, I'll tell you again. Sure, I'll tell you again. I just start with the internet. The good fares are still the way out. No, but I mean, thank you. There's some pretty decent fares out here. No matter if you're looking for retro stuff, but if you're just starting your games collecting, then this is definitely the way forward. <laughs> More VHS here. Yeah. The Garfield one. Let me pick up the Garfield. Oh, this one got Die Hard. Charlie Bucket. Smoke the Bucket. Ah. Oh. Ghostbusters 2. Let's see what else we've got. Underville Horrors. Which is an excellent case. The Lord of the Rings. Clearly not the Peter Jackson version. The Rings are my own price. Your feet, mate. Ten, ten ah, yeah, no, I, I, I've had a look through them. Yeah. I know. Cheers, pal. <laughs> yeah. Good morning, planet Earth. It is bank holiday Monday. It's pissing down outside. That can only mean one thing. I pack in the car and we're on my way to the Northeast Rep Road Den Nerdfest 2024. Hello, guys. Welcome to the setup of the Northeast Rep Road Den Nerdfest 2024. Right guys, just having a quick little walk around. Got Junior GRC here, dressed as Mirabella. Got the North East Fat Road Den lads there setting up. Big shout out Andy. And we've got Brabzy there. So we've got loads of stalls. Loads of vendors. Loads of cakes. Alright, man. Oh my god. Welcome to Jurassic Park. We've got a few more nerdy bits here. So, I've got quite the decent teenage dirt bag. Quite the, yeah, the decent little setup here. We've got DNA toys over there. Big shout out to the lads from Scotland. Oh, oh, Mr. Henderson. And we've got the boyos. Got some good toys on here. A box full of figures. Got some pretty impressive bits this year, haven't you? Someone's been squirreling away. Yeah. Right guys, well, since when do you get a box like that now? Uh, nah. Here is Jordy Retro Chaser Table. Northeast Retro Dens. East Affair, come grab your salad for We've got some little bits. Voila. Right guys, just having a little look at Simon Stone here. He's got some pretty decent stuff. A little bit, a little bit more modern. But it's got some pretty cool toys though. It's got the Five Night at Freddy's stitch there. I do like that world of Nintendo a bit. 
that's pretty decent. He might have to come home with us, even though we are trying to get rid of some stuff and not trying to take any home. Old school Star Wars. Yeah. Right guys, let's have a little trip down nostalgia lane. What we got here? Oh, look at him, what a beauty. Mario and Yoshi. Six quid. And we've got the goat. The greatest of all time. In my opinion. And we've got Metal Gear. Gear Boom. What else we got for sale on this wonderful booth? And we've got a nice Mario is missing. So yeah. Oh, we are stocked. Absolutely stock to so if you're looking for anything decent. Get yourselves down. Get the uh, got some Game Boy Advances, we've got some big box, the mega stuff. And we've got the more random bits, so we've got my little girl's earrings. VHS, remember all those VHS? There they are. Got loads of VHS for sale. And we've got our box of loose figs. Plenty of wrestlers in there. And we got our McDonald's toys. Three for a pound. There's some real good vintage McDonald's toys in here. If you want have a look, some of these are proper classics. And we got some more of the rare of the chess and some of the more box stuff. And then, of course, the Mario Malone cup. A little look see around. Oh wow, he's pretty sweet, isn't he? Yeah, man. What else we got? Oh, a bat of the future there. He's nice, 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 nice. Power Rangers. Decent fungus. All right, big shout out Chris Allison. Let's go have a look at his stall. All right, we've got some nice bits here. Yeah, I've got a bobblehead there. Family guy bits, yes, uh, and we've got some pretty decent figures here. So, we've got some classic McDonald's toys to a tenner. We might do some trades, and some TMNT, and some puppy or hair stuff. Don't need them ones though, got them ones. Pick up this little care bear. Got some of the decent GameCube stuff. Doing need. Cop door cart racers. But he's a bit of a heavy hitter. Anything else in here we need? Don't think there is. Nah. Nothing else in there that we need. Make sure I put Chris's games back because he uh, he has them in alphabetical order. We've got some pretty decent game boy collection here. Some of the other big hitters. Yeah. Boxster, look at the quality on the N64 man. Look at him. He is fucking minty. Okay, now we're John. Jaguar again, Mindy, Panasonic 3D or something we'll never very, very rarely see. And then, of course, big shout out to my mate Dean Taylor, who's not here, who only sells a mega CD stuff. And then, Hi guys, big shout out to Chris Allison and his stall. Some really nice stuff. How much has he got oh. on this? 40 quid. If you go back through with some of my. Uh, videos you'll find we found one of these at the food fair for 20. Kaboom! Alright guys big shout out AK Retro. This is the AK Retro store. Oh it's got some decent NES stuff in here. Let me see we haven't got Pac-Man. We've literally just paid 25 quid for him yesterday. Big shout out Megan for hooking us up with that. You ask me as I've already said the goat of games and then we have plenty loose NES cards 
look at all of that. Look them up guys, AK Retro. Find them on the socials. Give them a follow, give them a like. Give them a follow, give them a like. Quick look at the lads from uh, the Northeast Rep Road Den. Got the 32X there with Doom. Never really was a saying on my move. And he's always criticised us on the channel. For a GameCube collector, there's one we haven't got, which is the Resi Evil. We've got some of the fella stuff here. The Amiibo, Dr. Mario is still there. Do you need Dr. Mario like? I can't remember if I need IRS or not. I think I definitely need Honky Tonk Man though. And then we've got some vintage. This was a lot fuller before. Oh, God. Another honky tonk man, he's when you fire that's because he hasn't got his belt. I don't want to buy him in case I've already got him. I mean, if I've already got him, see, that honky tonk's got his belt. Virgil. Paid them a lot more than a fiver for my Virgil, I know that. Never mind. Alright, guys, well, we're going to try and not get a copyright strike here because of the bloody music in the background. But there is some so sweet bags here. These guys are a general staple here. Get on that man, come on lad. For all your Funko needs, these have got some pretty cool Funko stuff. So, let's keep having a little look here. Man. Some pretty cool artwork here guys. If you like this artwork, do me a favour, get on the socials and have a look at Driftboard please. Thank you. So I take it as where my little girl got her little cool dragon. Yes, we do have a card. Ah, there we go. Called Crescent Creations 3D. Make sure you look them up on their socials, please. For all your dragony needs. Check out cool group is. Go on, lad. Then we've got the general gaming area. Which unfortunately the control pad aren't here this year for some weird reason, but they're all the consoles set up, but a double dash what me and Junior GRC love playing. And you got Marvel vs. Street Fighter, good old Donkey Kong, of course, and a whatever of the TMNT. And of course, Dead or Alive, you're coming with me. So I've got the and then we've got our magic show. Just trying not to get too many people's children in. We've got Rabsy's store, which I think is blue-eyed comics, I think. Yes, it is. There it is. So again, if you're on your old socials, give Rabsy a look up for all your fungo needs. And of course, he does some pretty decent comics. So if you're in your comics, see, look at this, look at that one, man. Nice. Yeah, give him a look. Give him a follow. Do as a fear, my man. Alright, guys, well, that's us winding down at another Northeast Retro Dens Nerdfest 2024. Just want to say a big thank you to all the lads from the Northeast Retro Den. All the vendors, of course, all the consumers. Big shout out Sean Dixon, who I've been sharing the table with. Um, we'll be back here in October, so what I'm gonna do is, we're gonna fly back to GCHQ. Um, I'm not gonna show you the boot fair pickups because they're not as interesting as the pickups we've got from the fair. We picked up a few bits, got a nice bit of few GameCube things. So we'll head back to GCHQ now. I'll show you what we picked up, and that is us done for another video at Jordy Retro Chaser.
Hi right, guys, welcome back to Chase HQ. Just a quick pickups video from what we picked up from the Northeast Retro Dens Nerdfest 2024. I'm trying not to get me trotters in. We've got the Amiibo stand, so big shout out Nick Atkinson, hooking us up with both Super Mario Land and Dr. Spin, and of course, the Amiibo stand. Then we bought some of the stuff off the Northeast Retro Den lads, which being the three GameCube games. And then the main pickup being the dance stage Mario Party. All right, guys, that's it for this week. I just want to wish a big happy birthday to Junior GRC. As we can see, it is our sixth birthday party. So happy birthday, Junior GRC, and we will see you on the next video.